song. Wide See, range and anything by here. Enya. See? <laughs> <laughs> And now the latest in As the Egg Turns, starring Justin Bieber. Today, Los Angeles law enforcement executed a felony search warrant on the Biebs' house. Now, this comes after a neighbor complained that JB pelted his house with at least 20 eggs. So the sheriff's department detained about eight people who were in the home, including Bieber. The popo didn't find any eggs, but they did see in plain view cocaine. Oh. Now, according to TMZ.com, police arrested Bieber's longtime friend, rapper Lil Za, for narcotics possession. Egg bombing your neighbor and friends using coke in your home? Come on, JB. It's time to make that change. Now for the wonderful world of Kim Ye. Kanye West is now a suspect in an alleged assault case. Yesterday in Los Angeles, his fiance Kim Kardashian is walking into a building on Wilshire Boulevard for an appointment. The paparazzi start hounding her. So an 18-year-old defends her honor and tells him to back off by using derogatory words, including the N-word. Well, KK tells him he's out of line. He cops in, oh, no, you didn't attitude and calls her a B and an N-word lover. Well, she whips out her phone to call Super K Kanye. He swoops in. There's a heated exchange, and allegedly he goes all Muhammad Ali on the guy. Kanye, who has another assault charge against him, leaves before police arrive. Now Kim is filing a police report against the 18-year-old claiming he threatened to kill her. Kanye, have you ever thought about fighting ignorance with nonviolence? I'm just saying. We love them, yay, yay, yay. And so did the Grammys. The Beatles received the 56th Grammys Lifetime Achievement Award on January. January 26th. Paul McCartney and Ringo Starr will be there to accept the award and the cherry on top is that the two will also perform and I can't wait to see that. Lost in love, the one that you love. All out of love. Oh heck, let's just make love out of nothing at all. Take a deep <laughs> breath and inhale the love that's in the air. Air Supply is coming to town. The voices of Russell Hitchcock and Graham Russell are the perfect blend to create a night of romance. So get your tickets to see Air Supply. January 31st at the Akron Civic Theater. It's a great date night event. So. That's my twit book question of the day. What's the best love song of all time? And we have lots of romantics out there. Twit book was going crazy. Junie Melendez, Let's Stay Together by Al Green. Oh, that's a good one. Incognito. Oh, yeah. At last, Etta James. Patricia said, So Happy Together by The Turtles. Bruce, Ooh, Baby, Baby. Smokey Robinson and the Miracles. And Sue, Can't Help Falling in Love. Elvis Presley. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Mark, I can't believe no one suggested love in an elevator. Love in an elevator? <laughs> yeah, that should awesome. have been number one. Come on. <laughs> now, Unchained Melody. That's a good one. That. Dirty Deeds Done Dirt Cheap. <laughs> That's it. My favorite love song. Wide See, range and anything taste by here. Enya. See? <laughs>